Um, if you have a 1983 Lincoln cent, don't underestimate it as ordinary pocket change. Sometimes it isn't. This specimen, for example, recently fetched over $5,000 at a great collections auction. Hey there, coin enthusiasts and curious collectors. Welcome back to our channel where we uncover the hidden gems in your pocket change. Today, we're diving into the intriguing world of 1983 Lincoln Cents with a special focus on the elusive and highly sought after double die reverse DDR error. If you love discovering rare and valuable coins, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for more numismatic treasures. Now, let's get started. According to PCGS, due to the escalating prices of copper, Late in 1982, the mint stopped producing copper Lincoln cents, which weighed 3.1 grams. By 1983, the mint had already transitioned to a new zinc alloy, as it was much cheaper to produce Lincoln cents from zinc. Zinc cents should weigh 2.5 grams, while copper cents should weigh about 3.1 grams. There is at least one known 1983 cent weighing 3.1 grams, meaning it is composed mostly of copper. The 1983 copper cent is rare, even scarcer than the 1943 copper cents. Although the 1983 copper cent is not as publicized, an example in any condition would easily sell for thousands of dollars in the coin market. The 1983 double die reverse DDR is one of the most famous and valuable errors found on Lincoln cents. This error occurs when the reverse die used to strike the coins, the coins was hubbed twice with a slight rotation creating a noticeable doubling effect on the reverse side. Collectors can identify the 1983 DDR by examining the reverse of the coin closely. The doubling is most prominently visible on the inscriptions one cent, E pluribus unum, and United States of America. The letters will appear slightly doubled, giving a shadow-like effect. Magnification is usually required to see the doubling clearly. The 1983 Lincoln cent with the double die reverse error is highly prized among collectors. Its value varies significantly based on its condition and the clarity of the doubling. Take, for example, a recent auction where a stunning 1983 Lincoln cent with this error, graded Mint State 68 red by PCGS, fetched over $5,000 at Great Collections Auction. Thank you for joining us on this exciting journey into the world of the 1983 Lincoln Cent. If you enjoyed this video and found it informative, please give it a thumbs up, uh, share it with your fellow coin enthusiasts, and leave a comment below with your thoughts or questions. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more numismatic discoveries and insights.